What's going on, people? It's OJ, and I'm bringing you uh, a little Let's Play. Um, a Let's Play of what? Enslaved. And for you guys that don't know, Enslaved is basically, uh, let me see, I would guess like uh, a retelling of Dragon Ball Z, to put it lightly, because Dragon Ball Z is a retelling of an old Chinese novel. And this right here is more like uh, a more truthful telling of of the novel, but in a in a more futuristic setting. Because as we all know, well, a lot of people might not know the main character in, in this game, Monkey, he's Goku, and the girl in here basically is Boom. I haven't read the story to um, the novel. Because it's like 99 chapters and it's like long as fuck. I don't think there's any downloadable content, but if there is, I need that, son. Let me see. Let me make sure I'm just not talking to myself right here, real quick. Okay. And. Goddamn. Alright. That's enough of that. Alright. I'm, I'm not gonna be doing like the Let's Play like all the time. I'm gonna try to like balance it out and. Way I'm gonna do it is I'm gonna try to have 15 minutes of gameplay, like in every let's play. So if I'm talking or like there's a cutscene, I'm gonna try to like bounce it out. But not you know, fuck, you know, make sure there's at least 15 minutes, no matter like what happens. Can't do anything about loading screen right now. Okay. Oh yeah, during cutscenes, I'm just not talk because of you know, so you guys can hear what's going on and why stuff happens. Oh man, he looks mad as shit. That's Monkey, or as I'ma call him every uh every time, I'ma call him Goku. I just thought about something. I'm gonna turn on the fucking subtitles as soon as I dig out this little cutscene or whatever. Demo, that dude got fucked. Father, this guy looks like fucking the bomb. Shit, this game looks. Fucking gorgeous if you all can't tell. I don't know if you're looking at it in 720 or 1080. Well, right now it's 720, so I guess 720 is the most you're gonna get out of me. I used to do 1080, but 
Oh no, it, it takes too long. It takes like what? Mm, probably like ten hours to like do a Dragon Ball. Not a Dragon Ball Z. I'm just keep saying that for some reason, but like a battlefield, it takes me like ten hours to do like a battlefield, especially like a long game. This dude is fucking moving. I right, see it feels fluid as hell. Well, I'm not in the, in the combat right now, so I can't really say. Betrayal. <laughs> because that, that's their stuff, so I. Shit, I can't remember what I did in the fucking dump. Oh. There we go. Oh, shit, I can't get to the part. Uh oh. What's up, bro? What's my stuff? What? The stuff was my gear. The stuff you took away from me. I can't talk to you against the rules. Item storage in the lower hall. Oh, guys, I didn't know Goku had a New Jersey accent. I, mm, that's new to me. I just thought about that. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Betrayal. In the pipe. Pod eight launched. Seven. Seven pods remaining. Pods remaining. All right. All right. There we go. Get my, get my gear back. Careful. Careful. Oh yeah. Power glove. Oh yeah. Is it about to get real? Okay. That like really earns his name, Monkey. Wake up. Oh shit. You woke up at the wrong time, buddy. Yeah. 
What you want? What, what do you want, bro? Scrap metal. Shit. Superman punch. I don't know like how you like die in this because from where I, I don't really see like a health bar or anything. Come on. Almost fail. Oh, sh hey, 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 open the door. <laughs> <You mother f> <laughs> yeah, I think there was some gratuitous language right language right there. I don't know if you guys you know after watching this you guys haven't picked this game up. It's on like it's another GameStop fifteen dollars or whatever you got if you have a little card, definitely pick it up. I wasn't gonna pick up Catherine but in real life stuff came up so can't really get it. Well, I'm gonna get it like later on. Superman punch. Superman that hoe. Uh still uh, it's Kinda of feels weird. Oh, oh, you don't want any, bro? You got seriously outplayed. Yeah, I'll pick up Catherine later on, but I just thought about it. sixty dollars for like a single player game. Even though that game is probably is amazing and it has like a whole bunch of storylines and like endings and stuff. Right now, you know, that, that's a problem with a lot of uh, single player games. You hardly ever see people playing paying full price for them unless they're like bought out because you know once you beat a single player game what are you gonna do I mean, I mean it's not like it's multi it has multiplayer where you can do other stuff you only play for the story mode but I'm so worried about like Bioshock 2 I haven't seen like you know anything for like shit the multi almost got fucking Burn on a oh shit. Damn, this dude has ups. So worried about Bioshock because I, I'm hoping it has. Oh shit, we're in America? Okay, it must have came from. You know, it's Journey to the West. It must have came from. I, I, I don't even know because I, like I said, I haven't read the chapters or whatever. The, the whole movie. Not, not the move, not, not the whole movie, but I haven't read the original Japanese novel, so I don't know how it works. All thing I know about is Dragon Ball Z. That's the only thing I know about. Yeah, but I doubt, got a topic. All the dudes fucking beasting. Bioshock 2, so Bioshock Infinite. I'm so worried about that because I'm hoping it brings back the. Multiplayer from Bioshock 2, but with a little bit more balance because I want to get a game when it comes out on a uh, release. But no, without a a decent multiplayer, there's nothing really to like justify getting a single player game on the first day, and that's just me. Oh, Guys, shit. Oh, I thought I'd die. Oh, my. Let's 
survivor. This dude just is fucking acrobatic, acrobatic, and like big and like strong as fuck. It doesn't like his body type doesn't really. Oh, this shit's gonna sound kind of gay, but like when you look at his body type, you wanna think like this guy's like some kind of like super jumping shit. Yeah. Okay. Bitch, how you gonna leave me? I'm a fucking pimp. Thank guys, I'm gonna cut it off right here. And you know, if you enjoyed it, let me know. I'm gonna try to keep doing this. Well, I wouldn't do it like every day or whatever, but you know, every once so often you're gonna see this pop up. And I'm free. And I'm just <coughs> as you see the game, I'll be seeing the game too. You no, know, it's not like I did like a playthrough. So every time I get an achievement, it's new to me as it is to you. So I'm gonna let this last cutscene play and then um I'm gonna cut it off. It's ripped open. It's the headband. <sighs> what? The slave headband. The one I fit on you. You put this on me. Let me explain. Get this thing off, or I'm gonna rip your head off. No. No? You think I'm screwing with you? You! You man, stop! Ah! It works. Come here, move away from me. Ah! Oh. What the hell are you doing? I hacked a slave headband. Oh. So it could be activated by my voice commands. Ah. Activation triggers a systemic pain response. That's what controls the slaves. I'm not gonna kill you. You can't. If my heart stops beating for any reason, the headband will discharge a lethal dose. If I die, you die. Oh. Why? I need your help. I come from a wind farmer community. It's about 300 miles from here. I'll never make it on my own. If slavers don't get me a mech will. That's the deal. Get me back to my home and you can go back to yours. Look, 
Looks like I don't have a choice. Neither of us do. I'm sorry. Let's go.